Hello everyone. Today we will going through the programming that is basically of 15 marks. Correct now? First you write down the question because question I am not writing. The question is write a program to input a string and find out number of uppercase, number of lowercase, number of digits and number of special characters. Means the programming is what? You have to input a string and you have to find out how many capital letters are there? Uppercase means capital letters. How many small letters? That is lowercase. How many digits? Digits means uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. And special character. For example, at the rate sign, has sign. Uh, these all signs are called as special characters. So these all things we have to find out. We have to calculate. We have to uh, mention. We have to print the output as that number. Number of uppercase, lowercase, special characters and digits. So let's see the practical. So you can see here, the first line is the package declaration that is import java.util.asterisk. The next is class abc that is the class name. This is the package package for the scanner class. This is the class. The class name is what? abc. Then after this is the main function. The main function we declared and then we declared the, we made one object that my object name is sc. sc is a scanner object. By using that we will call the string. Then we I made four variables. L O U P S P D I. I think uh, it is uh, the possibility is what the first time I think you will see in this type of declaration by me or any of the book it is not given. But this is the shortcut and the correct way to declare a variable with initialization. So the initial value of L O L O for lowercase, uppercase, special character and digit. And this is 0 is the initial value. The initial value is what? 0. So I declared one va four variables and the value is 0. So in a, within one line I complete this one. Then I meant I mentioned one uh, uh, message. Enter a string. A string I have to input. The string name is what? st. st equals to next int or next line. Next line. Okay now. Next line. Next int for integer. But next line for that is string input. So st equals to st dot next line and thereafter the index number for loop this for loop is for the index number. Index number of any of the string is starting from 0. Work till less than whatever the length of the string st dot length and increment value is plus 1 that is 0 then 1 then 2 then 3 then 4 like that it is increasing. Thereafter I use that caret function to read the character and this particular character one by one stored in ch. Now I have to work on ch. If the value of ch is greater than capital A and ch value is less than capital Z, the value of up, that up value in beginning what is that? 0. The value of up will be increased by plus 1. Okay now, means as the number of uppercase capital letter we will get the value of up will increase by plus one plus one plus one like that now the same thing i did if you see else part and thereafter again if i use and this is for the checking of small letter uh, character must be greater than equals to small a character must be uh, less than equals to small z the value of lo will be increased by one the again i am checking for in uh, digits that is character is greater than equals to 0 and less than equals to 9. All digits are coming in between 0 to 9. So that digits will be di variable will be increased by 1. Correct now? Else if this will be false, this part will be false, this part will be false. Obviously which part will work? This part will work. Else part will work. That will be a special character. Correct now? For example, if I am writing here ampersand at the rate. Now this, I am checking for this. Now ampersand is it is not coming in between a to z. It is not coming in between small a to z. It is not coming in between 0 to 9. Then obviously this particular thing is the special character. So this will increase the value by plus 1. Like that we find all the numbers. So the output I printed at the last that system.out.println uh, up for uppercase LO for lowercase, DI for digits and SP for the special characters. 
and one more thing i use a shortcut here system.out.println but don't use never use this shortcut correct now so printing statement upi printed loi printed dii printed spi printed this programming containing 13 marks in board exam very important vvi very important for the board exam this is a 13 marks programming and plus 2 for the variable description variable description so all together this will be of 15 marks variable description i think you all know so this one uh, you please go through the programming understand the programming and if any doubt will be there then uh, definitely during the online class you can ask me i'll explain to you okay now so thank you everyone have a nice day